Hello friends and welcome back to our Wednesday whipping chat. As promised, we have our cobblestone bridge out and ready. Problem is I have everything in these little bags because when I stored this away to start working on my doggy painting, which coincidentally is under here, um, I had these little bags and I don't like it, but this is what we're gonna do because I need to just go ahead and get this done. Um, as you can see, I've got them labeled with their number, oh, well, their number and the cute little symbol that goes with it. Like this one is A05 and it's got a little circle here. So that's what we're doing today. Um, so just to get moving, cause this is not gonna be a long whip and chat. My children are not gonna be gone very long. They are down to the lunch truck getting their lunch and playing on the swings, but I guarantee it won't be that long. I'm sorry if the video is um, weird, but we do our best around here, you know? I just wanna say hi to you guys. So how is everyone? How have you been? What you been doing in the past week? Um, I did get the messages on the last week's video, which we will be going over. I can't believe I did all that for one drill, okay. I don't know what I was doing with this painting because I have this area here to finish, but there's also an area down in the corner that's started and needs to be finished. Uh-oh, that's gonna be bad because it's not sticky anymore down here. Oh boy. Hmm, seems like someone spilled salt or something on it. I'm gonna have to Oh boy, get a baby wipe and see if that will work. If not, I'm sure glue will do the trick. Because, <laughs> um, yeah, we have to finish that. That's a pretty big chunk of, of um piece there. Now, the one I'm looking at, yeah, here it is. I was going to say, I just had that piece or that symbol because <laughs> I was just showing you guys. All right, so as for me, now that I found out how you guys are doing and everyone's well, Hopefully, as for me, last week, I really don't have too much to talk about, honestly. What was that on my painting? It's like a hair. Cool. Okay, whatever. Anyway, um, Thursday, not much. Not much happened. Spent some time with my husband. Um, and the kids, as I do every day. <laughs> and that's about it. That's all I did on Thursday. I didn't do anything. I'm trying my hardest to stay out of this heat. Um, it is 100 degrees pretty much every day here now. And I'm not happy. So, oh yeah, that's right. I was going to say, am I putting that on the right symbol? Um, if you guys remember, I struggled so hard to tell these symbols. I have a um, uh, a light, can't think of the name of it at this present moment, that goes um, under this, but I don't feel like dealing with it right now. I don't like the fact that you have to constantly keep it plugged in in order for it to work. Um, yeah, I don't like that. And I don't have a plug long enough, a cord long enough, to um to use it at my kitchen table really anywhere i don't have a plug long enough anywhere to use it so we're just gonna go the way that it is and hope that i'm putting these on the right symbol yeah okay now um yeah thursday i didn't do much at all Friday was very fun. Oh, I'll show you. Oh, see my bracelet? Do you know what that is? It's Fortnite! No, I do not play Fortnite. I do not like Fortnite. I have nothing in my soul that wants me to be a part of the Fortnite community at all. However, my son loves Fortnite and he's really really good at it he plays it a lot every day every single day 
<laughs> my son will get up and do his chores and go straight to Fortnite. Um, so anyway, um, the library, probably about 20 minutes from us in the next town over, um, did a Fortnite night day, a Fortnite day. I don't know. It was Fortnite themed. Okay. And uh, um, so we went to that. I had signed him up for it weeks ago. I was dashing and I happened to go into a Sonic. Lovely, lovely Sonic. Their food is absolutely amazing. Anyway, I was in Sonic picking up an order. And I just saw on the paper, it just said Fortnite. So I was like, oh, okay, let me grab this. It says Fortnite. I don't know what it is. I'll give it to my son. Anything Fortnite, you know, I've had to make him a Fortnite shirt that he won't wear to school because he said that people will laugh at him. Oh, by the way, guys, look at this little... <laughs> I use these. I'm sorry, I'll get right back to the Fortnite in just a second. I use these to put my drills in, but they're so small. So I use it for a trash drill. You know, for trash drills. I just stick them in there. Or wandering drills that end up, you know, somewhere that they're not supposed to be. You know, how that goes. Okay, so anyway, back to Fortnite. Um, wait, wait. Oh, we're looking for this one right here. Cool. Um, it was so much fun. It was so much fun. I thought I was just going to drop my son off. And let him do his little Fortnite thing. And then I was going to come back to get him. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. They had tables set up for the parents. They didn't at first. Because I guess they didn't think that any parents would really want to stay. But I was like, yeah, I don't know you people. I'm not leaving my son here. Um, yeah, so I'm staying. <laughs> and it was cute because they had like the... Whatever the bus is. I think it's called like the party bus or... The, something I don't know but they had the bus I had a little blow-up bus and they had um refreshments which that's the reason I didn't leave you know of course I wanted to make sure my son was okay but I saw snacks and they said they were ordering pizza at seven so I was like where can I sit where can I sit? Like, I'm not leaving. You've said magic words. And now I want to sit and watch my son play Fortnite, my fave. Like, I never even knew I loved Fortnite. Right? That's how I was feeling. Why doesn't this look like enough? Hmm. Hopefully these are the only L's. Just looks like a couple. What is that? The chimney? Wait, is that an L or a... Oh, jeez. Hold on. Before I end up... See, this... I'm glad I looked. I was going to put that in the wrong place. This is the... Um, the little greater than symbol. I think that's what that is. Whatever. It's not what I'm looking for. How about that? So, I sat there... Giovanni and my grandbaby Anaya um, attacked the balloons. What is that? Yeah, they, they had balloons and everything in there. So um, they were playing with the balloons, smacking them across the room and hitting people and they did not care. It was such a good environment. Like <laughs> anytime you can go somewhere and smack a balloon at someone and hit them in their head and they laugh and hit the balloon back at you. That's a good time. That is a good time. So they had a contest where my son, Quez, uh, you could win a thousand um, V Bucks if you won on the Battle Royale, is what they call it. It's like you got to fight, you got to kill, go through and kill like 30 people, I think it is, or something like that. And if you win a battle royale, you would get the thousand V-Bucks. Well, my son, oh my, come back here. My son had to go through and set up his, like his controller settings and everything. And by the time he finished that, there had already been two winners. And I was like, Quezzy, you got to get this last one. 
because mom does not have any money. Sis is broke. Sis does not have money. I am sis. Okay, that is me. I'm going to need you to win. <laughs> and he says, say less. And probably within 15, 20 minutes, he said, I win. And I was like, wow. Good job, son. $8 mommy's saved. <laughs> so it was really nice. And then we ate. We had pizza from a place called Tony's Pizza. Oh, probably the best pizza I've had. I was like, whoa, wait, what? Where where do I go to get this? Where is Tony's Pizza? Because I will come all the way here anytime I want pizza. Like, you're going to give me this. I know you are. So we did that. And then um, they had a dance competition where you had to know the Fortnite dances. That was fun. My son came in third place. Uh, there was a little girl that killed everything because she did like backhand spring jump twist. She flipped backwards, okay, like a backflip. And one guy that was in second place ended up doing the worm. It was so funny. I was like, oh my God, okay. Because the last 30 seconds they could freestyle and do whatever dance they wanted to do. And so he got down on, you know, his belly and did the worm, proceeded to do the worm all over the floor. And I have it on video. It was so funny. I was like, oh my gosh, people still do that? Like, what? Not the worm. <laughs> it was funny. But yeah, so we did have a great time. Giovanni came home and probably went to sleep within 10 minutes of being home. He didn't even get his bath before bed because he was so tired. He just basically was like, look, I can get a bath in the morning. You know, there's no designated time for me to have a bath. So I'm going to sleep now. And I said, okay, son, because I'm with you. I'm going to sleep too. Um, it was just a lot of fun. It really was. Um, I like anywhere that has all you can eat. And I just constantly was like, ooh, pizza, that's really good. I think I had like three pieces of pizza. Oh, my God. I don't uh, don't tell anybody else, guys. This is between us, okay? All right. And don't judge me. <laughs> the pizza was so good. I had like three pieces. And they had water and Gatorade and chips and chocolate cupcakes. Well, they had cupcakes. Um, they said something about a drop or something. I don't know. A loot drop or something drop that has to do with Fortnite. And, um... That's what they were calling that. And then everybody got a bag. Everybody who was registered got a bag with um, different stuff in it. So that's where this bracelet came from. Um, my son had a tag with his name on it. Like he literally had to go and register. It was just so cute. It was really, really cute. Um, they called me like an hour prior to it starting. And they were like, yeah, the library called me. It was like, we just want to let you know we're ready whenever you are. And I was like, is my son the only one? Because, like, why are, you, why are you telling me you're ready whenever I am? Like, I thought it was supposed to start at 5. So, um, we went and we got there on time. And it was just really a nice time. Like I said, I don't know anything about Fortnite. But I'm glad my son got to have fun. I really am. Because it meant a lot to him. Um, uh, by the way, prior to us going, probably about 15 minutes before we were going, Giovanni, you know, you're going to hear his name at least once in this, <laughs> in every whip and chat, because he always does something. He, um, took a second out of his life to run up to my other son, Giovanni, or Quezzi, the one that was doing the Fortnite thing. And as we are getting ourselves all ready, my daughter, Myra, was putting on her shoes. I come out of my bedroom and I hear, bro, what are you doing? Come on. And my son, Quez, was laying on the couch, holding his head. Well, Giovanni strikes again because Giovanni was trying to play with his brother and he got mad because his brother wouldn't play with him. And he literally 
headbutted his brother. The only reason Giovanni cried was because I guess it hurt a little bit. It hurt him a little bit. But because I was coming down the hallway. And he wanted to tell me that Quezzy had hit him. Okay, like we really don't need that on our diamond painting. Like I don't even know why that would happen right now. Yeah, so I was like, what in the world is happening right now? See, this is why I don't like the blue tack because it gets stuck all over my painting sometimes. I usually use glue dots for the glue. <laughs> but yeah, it literally just gets stuck on my painting. Um, goes right there. Mm -hmm. Anyway, yeah, he proceeded to headbutt his brother. His brother goes in the bathroom and looks because he's like, you know, I'm still going to this Fortnite thing, like whatever. And he has a colossal size lump on the front of his head, on his forehead. I didn't know whether to take him to the hospital, to the Fortnite thing, or stick his head in the freezer. Like, I did not know what to do. Like, I was like, whoa. So, I don't, I don't keep ice in my freezer. Um, I, cause all, usually all I drink is water out of water bottles. I go buy water bottles from Walmart all the time. So I didn't have um, any ice. So I gave him a frozen water bottle to stick on this mountain in the front of his head. And I was like, yeah, we're not going. He was like, no, I wanna go. I said, you can't go like that. They're gonna think I did it. <laughs> Like, you're definitely not going. And he got all sad and everything. And I was like, okay, if that goes down in the next 10 minutes, we can go. I cannot tell you how hard this boy pushed this water bottle on his head to try to get this to go down in 10 minutes. It was crazy. Guarantee by the time we left out that door, that thing was gone. He was like, oh, no, 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 no. Mm -mm. We're going. And I said, okay, well, here we go. Well, we did. I'm glad we went. We had a lot of fun. Everyone was exhausted. Um, the gentleman that put it together even gave Giovanni and um, my grandbaby, Naya, bags. He gave them loot bags. I thought that was so cute. What am I looking for? Oh, this. Yeah, he gave them loot bags. And I was like, oh, that's so sweet of you. <laughs> he didn't want to leave them out. So that was nice. I can't really think of anything else that happened this week. So we are going to go to the comments and see what we have. I know Smurfette left a comment and Jesse left a comment. Hi guys, I know you're here. Love you. Okay, um, let me see. I have to look on my tablet and I don't use my tablet very often unless I am diamond painting. Let me turn it down so that nobody. Oh my God, am I the only one that listens to 911 calls? Ugh, probably. <laughs> okay, so let's get to my last weapon chat. Here it is. Okay, so, yep, Jesse and Smurfette. Okay, so. Jessie's is first. Hers just pops up first. So I'm going to read yours first. It says, hey, Roxy, I'm so glad you're back. Oh, thank you. I'm glad to be back. I feel so good about being back. So sorry to hear about what your family is going through. Sending big hugs to all of you. I don't really watch gaming videos, but I have recently discovered the joys of Twitch. Ooh, I love Twitch. And thank you for the hugs um, for... Um, you know, my family, because it's it's a lot right now, but we're we're making it. So thank you so much for the hugs. Um, yes, I love Twitch. Twitch, I watch. I can't find too much diamond painting on there though. And then the ones that I did find was like in a different language. So I usually have to watch them like with a vibe. Oh, I missed two T's, really? 
with the volume turned down. Is those tees? Yep. I'll go back for them. Uh, anyway, I have to watch it with the volume turned down because it's the, like they're not in English. So I was thinking about putting diamond painting on my, like doing it live. I'm just not sure how to do that because <laughs> I have to sit to my kitchen table. So I don't know. But anyway, lots of gamers and crafters over there, even some diamond painters. Not much has been going on here. Unfortunately, can't really afford to do much of anything. Uh, I'm with you on that one. Ugh, good thing that Fortnite thing was free. <laughs> my 15 month old has his very first ear infection. Oh no. Oh, that is terrible. Newborns, you know, babies and ear infections. I don't even think they should be put in the same sentence because it is horrible when your child has an ear infection. So I am, I am really with you on that when I know exactly what you're going through. Um, and four molars coming in at once. Oh, no. And I'm over it. I bet you are. I totally bet you are. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that sounds terrible. Well, I hope your baby is feeling better soon. And hopefully by now, you know, everything has worked out. Your infection is gone and um, the little teeth have come in, I guess. Oh, God, I hope. <laughs> um Thank you so much for your comment, Jesse. I really appreciate seeing your comment. It makes me smile. <laughs> okay, so to Smurfette, she says, welcome back, dearie. Thank you. Please never apologize for not responding back. I continue to pray for you to have strength and peace. Thank you so much, Smurfette. Um, like, just like I told Jesse, I really need it. Okay, uh, sorry to hear about your daughter's situation. I pray she'll be okay and heal from this and it makes her a stronger woman. We're just steady praying for her. That's really all we can do. Um, it's just, just pray for her. That's, that's really all we can do. Um, the 4th of July sounded like you had a good time. I laughed at them splashing you, but glad you were able to dry off without changing clothes. That's good summer weather right there. Yeah, it was really hot. All I had to do was stand in the sun for just a few minutes and... All of a sudden, my dress was dry. Like, yay. I'm not sure why I became the target of the children. But they decided to splash me with a water balloon. And I was like, yeah, great. Thanks. Can you hand me a water bottle? Yeah. Thank you, daughter. Appreciate you. Okay. Um, okay, so what sorcery is that pen you have? You're literally pasting four at a time. Oh, my multi-placer. These should come with your kits. I'm not sure if they come with Amazon kits, but they're multi-placers. They have two, four, I think they have all the way up to a 15-placer. Me using a 15-placer will never happen. Mm -mm. But um, I get these a lot when I order things from Amazon, like when I order storage or if I get a pen, they'll give you multi-placers. Check your, um, your kit and see if a multi-placer come with it. Four is the max that I do right now. I tried seven placers and I was like, yeah, no. <laughs> so yeah, you should have it. Um, no wonder you get done so much faster. <laughs> yeah, I just started using my multi-placer. I was afraid of it. I really was. I was like, yeah, I don't think... I'm going to be able to do this. But once I realize it does not matter if these drills are perfectly straight, I am not a perfectionist. All the time. I'll put it like that. <laughs> I'm not a per perfectionist all the time. Um, so I don't care if the drills are straight because if they don't straighten themselves out, ugh, the painting is still done and I still like it. So yeah. It's easier to use the multi-placer with rounds because they're just going to go where they want to go anyway. So um, as you can see, my drills are not straight. You might not be able to see it. But when I hang this up, which I'm thinking about giving this away, I'm thinking about um, either doing a giveaway or just picking someone. Is that an empty space with a nine on it? Oh my gosh. Anyway. Or just picking someone. Right now, it's you or Jesse in the comments. So, um, I might just pick 
um, one of my subscribers or something like that to give this away to because I don't really have anywhere to put it. Uh, yeah, that's what I usually do with my diamond paintings um, or what I'm going to be doing is giving them away. So we'll see. Um, also, I noticed yours are square gems where mine are oval, oval kind of jelly at the moment. Oh, uh, I started with rounds like this. I started with rounds and, um, I was scared to do squares, like scared. I'm, I'm looking for, I hate working in baggies. Oh, just drives me nuts. Here it is. Okay. So yeah, I started with rounds. My first couple paintings were rounds and I like them, but I didn't want to be intimidated by squares. So I bought my first square painting um, was a partial, I believe. I think it was the Hawaiian sunset that I did. That's a nine up here, guys. Ooh, did you just fall off? Why would you do that to me? rude okay so yeah um my hawaiian sunset that i bought was i think my first square or maybe that was round two. Oh, you know what my first square was dahlia that was my first square painting so let's see where we're at on time oh, we're good with time yeah so ever since i will do either one sort um, rounds are quicker they are much quicker. Um, squares, you got to be very ugh, dainty. and I don't care about it, though. I'm like, yeah, right, whatever. All right. Um, so, yeah, no need to be jelly. Don't be jealous. It's fine. You can go get you a square painting. If you have a Hobby Lobby anywhere near you, go in Hobby Lobby um, on the weekends where they have their 40% off discount. And get yourself a square painting, girl. Just do it. <laughs> Okay, um, how long did it take you to do each dog? Oh, the other two. Oh, you're talking about my um, bookshelf, my doggy bookshelf. I, I only work on my diamond paintings for a couple of hours a day. Now, when I first opened any kit that first day, I'm going to work on it for hours. Like, I could be at my kitchen table all day. Um, of course, getting up to, you know, take breaks and stretch and things, but... Um, yeah, that's right. My symbol is just backwards. But anyway, yeah. Um, when I first start working on a kit, it's the excitement of just having something new to work on and seeing how the drills turn out and, you know, how pretty it is. Um, which, by the way, Smurfette, did you ever finish your diamond painting? Let me know if you finished it. Oh, also, Jesse, if you can leave me or somehow send me the link to your Instagram, I think that's what you said, where you do your diamond paintings. Um, I remember a couple of videos back, I asked for, you know, if anyone would like to show me their diamond paintings. And I think you said Instagram. If I'm wrong, please forgive me. But if it is, send me um, the link to your Instagram page somehow. I'm not sure how to do that but if you can <laughs> let me know what your name is on there or something so that I can go and check out um what you have going on um I don't really post my diamond paintings anywhere I belong to a um diamond art club VIP group and I will like show updates on there but yeah I don't maybe I will though that's a good idea Oh, anyway, back to your comment. Mm. So it took me a couple of days to do um, the puppies. I don't anticipate being done with that for about a good month. Maybe. If I, if I work on it just by itself and like when I finish this one, it won't take me that long. Um, but if I alternate between the other three whips I have, <laughs> it's going to take me about a month, maybe a month and a half. 
yeah. I I have a very low attention span, so I get bored easily with the same thing over and over. So that's why I have so many whips. Okay. Um, the way your gems are in those plastic containers makes it so much faster to get yours done. Mine are in plastic bags, but that's Amazon for you. Oh, are you talking about these? I literally bought these. I got it from Amazon. It is a kit that you can get. It's got the case and everything. And you get 64 of these. Mm -hmm. uh, also, I showed you these. I believe I showed you guys these. I bought these at the Dollar Tree. There's like five or six of them in a bag. And they have different sizes. Like I got this, but I also have these little ones. You can use whatever you want to. Before I bought these, I had my kids eating TikTok, TikTok, <laughs> Tic Tacs like crazy, and they don't even like Tic Tacs. <laughs> but I needed cases for my um for my drills because I don't like working out of baggies. It it just slows me up. It really does. So yeah, go in Dollar Tree if you have one or um uh walmart anywhere there are a lot of things you can use that are like multi-purpose but you can use for your drills to make it easier for you the only reason i have them in baggies is when i'm not working on them i put them back in baggies so that it can free up my storage all right um hold on rope drills all right that sounds so sweet to pass it along. Will you frame it for them or are you framing any of the ones you'll be doing? Mm, um, I'm not sure about framing the dog bookshelf. I might let them do that on their own because that is going to be expensive. That is a huge painting and it is going to be very expensive to, um, to frame it. And then... Um, with this one, whoever I give it to, which I have someone in mind, but whoever I give it to, I would have to pay extra for the shipping if I frame this one. It would cause it to be heavier. So, I don't know. Oh, there's a fly in my kitchen. Oh, I hate flies. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I don't know about framing them. Um... I'm going to seal them, even though they say if you frame them, you don't have to seal them. But I don't know. I might. I've heard some people say that when you seal them, it takes the gloss off of your gems or your um, drawers. It makes them like not as shiny. Oh, jeez, come on. And that is the part of diamond painting that I love the most is looking at all the little shiny drills. Where'd you go? Uh, here's two of you. I like this painting, but it's so dark. Like, the colors are so dark. And I think that's the reason I went to the doggy bookshelf, because I saw that they had really, really red. Like, a lot of red. Oh, I knew you guys just saw that fly. He flew right in the camera. He wanted to say hi. All right, anyway, um... The tape, where do you get it from again? I believe you're talking about this. Washi tape. Dollar Tree. I got this. Well, now they should call it the Dollar 25 Tree. But I got this one. I got this one. So I got both of these, a dollar 25 each. Um, like I said, I buy a lot of my supplies from Dollar Tree. Uh, I have a whole drawer of washi tape. This came with the dog bookshelf, I believe. Um, this, I have a whole drawer full of it. Let me just take the whole drawer out. Ta-da! <laughs> a lot of this came from the dollar store. Dollar General. I do not spend a bunch of money buying this stuff. I do not. <laughs> At all. I do not, and I will not. Because the paintings themselves are expensive enough. So, yeah. I just made my last paint payment on the um, dog bookshelf. So, I won't be buying another one for a while. I'm just going to work on the ones I have. 
All right, what else do we say here? Um, do the painting. Oh, do the painting and record when you can. We'll be here. Thank you so much. That means a lot. It really does mean a lot because I don't have very many followers on this channel. I had 20, I think, and someone must have unsubscribed. <laughs> I'm so sad. Um, so now we're we're down to 19. <clears throat> but yeah, so it 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 helps me that to know that I don't have to have a whipping chat out every Wednesday. Um because it is a lot. It really is. It is a lot to do these whipping chats. And, you know, with all the things that I have on my phone, sometimes it only lets me um, record. Like this recording is only going to be like 50 minutes because that's all it's letting me record. I've deleted things off of my phone, games, videos, everything. And I'm going to make sure. Okay. Um, and... It still only gave me 50 minutes, so what ifs? I'm just temperamental. I'd like to get an actual camera, um, like an actual camera that I can record with. I would love to be able to do that, but you know, <laughs> finances. I'm going to put up a GoFundMe and see if <laughs> someone can fund me to get a camera. <laughs> you know, I'm just kidding. I'm really not going to do that, but yeah, um, that's what I want to do, though. I do want to get a camera. Okay. All right. Um, and yay for stone block. I did put up the first one. I, I'm not sure if I put up part two. I think I put up part. No, I put up part two of my career legacy challenge. Um, but I will be putting up a part two probably tomorrow for stone block. So I hope you're enjoying it. <laughs> um, are you going to get the high school pack when it drops? I'm probably going to wait on that. I think it'll be fun, but I'm not buying it right away. Going to see other play first this time around. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm going to do, too. I'm going to um kind of wait to see other people play it. But I feel like everybody gets so excited for these packs. And they saturate YouTube with it so much that, you know, you be like, wait a minute. I want that pack. And then you're sitting there like, wait, do I really want that pack? Or is it just because I'm seeing it everywhere and everybody else seems to have that pack? Um, I have no desire in me at all to buy the werewolf pack. Not at all. Uh, I don't see the point in that pack. <laughs> I really don't because I'm like, oh boy, this is not The Sims 3 Supernatural. Like... I'm going to need y'all to come up with something new for The Sims, please. Um, I mean, like, really, please. <laughs> something that we actually can do. I like the scenarios, but they are so quick. Like, they are so incredibly quick. Um, that's why I stopped doing the scenarios challenge that I was doing and did the career legacy challenge because it's pretty much the same thing. But it's just that I was doing it with the scenarios. And each generation was going to have a different job. So it was the same thing. So I decided to stop doing the scenarios legacy challenge and just do a career legacy challenge because that's really what I was doing anyway. So, yeah. Oh, excuse me. Um... Yeah, so I don't, yeah, I don't think I'm going to buy it as soon as it comes out. I'll probably wait a couple weeks. Are you going to come up? Thank you. Yeah, I'll probably wait a couple weeks <clears throat> before I do that. Um, I think right now the only thing I'm going to be doing on my channel, uh, on my Sims channel, is the Career Legacy Challenge because I'm getting a little bored. <laughs> I'm getting a little bored. Um, Jaleesa's story is not as entertaining as I wanted it to be. And I can't think of where to take her story. Like, 
I don't know what to do with her. I mean, if you have any suggestions, by all means. Um, she's already adopted her cat, Taco. <laughs> and she's adopted a son, King. So, I don't know what to do. Like, I don't know where to carry her story. Um, the mother's story was so... I don't know where that creativity went because that was so interesting. I was watching my own videos. That's how interesting it was. I was like, wait, what? Mm, what happened? And I'm the one that did the video and I'm asking, you know, like, oh my God, what happened? I need to go back and watch. That first season of uh, Mommy and Me was, <laughs> it was a mess. It really, really was a mess. But they made it through. And now Leah is having issues. So, yeah. But it looks like I'm almost out of time, guys. Is this is what I need? Yes. It looks like I'm almost out of time. I'm at, I got about 10 minutes left. So, yeah. I am in the mood for some ice cream. And I just found out that my daughter just went to Sonic and did not take me. She took the boys to Sonic. Oh, that was one of the other things they gave us at the um, Fortnite thing is uh, free um, coupons to get lemonade. Uh, what is it called? A strawberry something lemonade. Anyway, they're delicious. <laughs> and they didn't leave the babies out. They gave Giovanni one. They gave Naya one. And that's what I really just enjoyed about it. Because I was like, wow, they're giving this to everybody. It's like everybody left with something. Even the babies. So I was very, very happy about that. It just made me really happy. Um, hmm. I don't want to work out of baggies anymore. <laughs> Probably the next time you guys see this, we'll be on our last square. Um, because I don't want to like saturate my channel with the same painting. I don't know if it matters to you guys or not, but um, I feel like doing like maybe three or four parts of the same painting and then you know, moving on to something else is good. But you guys let me know what you think. If you want me to work with this, uh, um, with like maybe the last two sections or something of that nature. But I am going to work on this in between parts because it's a lot. I don't recall looking at anyone else's channel and seeing them just working on the same painting like every time you got back to them. So, I don't know. I don't know if that's, like, not a thing or how it's supposed to work. I guess I could do it any kind of way I want it to. Like, I don't have to follow everyone else. But, you know, just let me know what you guys think. And I, you know, I'll just do the dog bookshelf in between parts and not work on this if that's what you guys want. If you want us to complete this together, just leave it in the comments. Let me know. All right, so, um, yeah, I think that's going to be it for today. Uh, my daughter just came in a little bit ago. She was the one I asked for the water. I see one E, one stray E that I must have missed. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish this. And probably on the next part, we'll work on another part. If that's what you guys want to do. If you want to see something different, I have um, Strength Along the Journey. I have my dog bookshelf. I have another one that I'm working on, but I don't know if it's licensed. So I don't want to do that one. Let me know what you guys want to do. Okay. Um, Stone Block Part 2 will be up tomorrow. Smurf effect. So be on the lookout for that. Okay, so thank you all so much for coming to my channel and joining me for this whipping chat. I hope whatever you were working on, you got more done than I did. Um, Smurfette, if you finished your painting, you know you can get me on Twitter, um, Facebook. <laughs> you are even on my TikTok now. So <laughs> if you want to post it, that's fine. You can come in. I'm almost done. If you want to post it on your, tic on your TikTok, um, just tag me in it and I will see it. Okay? So thank you guys so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this and I will see you all next week. Okay.